Hi guys, welcome back. We are continuing our journey through Pokemon Red. Let's have a chat to this kid, see what he's got to say. See what he's got to say for himself. Yo! You can jam out if you got a Pokemon trainer. If you're a Pokemon trainer. Is that what he said? Is that what he said? Some of the crap these kids say. Bugcatcher wants to fight. Does he now? He sent out a Weedle. That's all they have. Um, squirt butt. Uh, tackle. Tackle that boy. There we go. Oh, critical hit. Nicely done. It's going down. Oh, poison. No. Again. That's the problem about these bloody um, bug types. They're just, they're super weak, but they just poison you and they just slowly but surely mm, drag you down. Tackle. Done. Was that his only Pokemon? I think it was, wasn't it? Grew to level 11. Getting big and strong, my friend. Oh, he's got others. Should we get, um... Let's get Riders in here. Can I, like, change you, man? Can I change the order here? Uh, no. Um... Come on, Riders. Slow ride. Boom, boom, boom. See, that Gust is a normal type attack, so I don't think it's going to have much effect on the bug. Because the bugs are obviously weak to birds in the same way that birds eat bugs. <laughs> so I think when Pidgey learns like a, uh, a flying attack, I think the first, I think there's a, I can't remember what the first move he learns as a flying attack, but yeah, uh, he will soon chop these guys up. Come on, Pidgey. Nicely done. Oh, look at that. Oh, nearly. Nearly one hit. Ah, bloody string shot. Not a fan of these status inducing effects. Level 11. They're getting, they're, cool. they're getting so big and strong already. Nicely done, Pidge. Nicely done, riders. Riders up in here. What, 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 what? Um, oh, bloody squirrel's got poison. Oops. Um, nicely done, boy. Up we go. Come on, I want a, I want a Caterpie. Ah, oh, we do. I'm alright in thinking that Caterpies only appear in Pokemon Blue. I'm not quite sure. I'm pretty sure both Weedles and Caterpies appear in um, both games. So, oh, Squirt Butt. You're letting the side down, mate. Come on, Squirt Butt. String Shot. Stop. Oh, well, I prefer status inducing effects rather than a. Uh, ah, oh, don't poison me again. I like how you give me a critical hit and then you took like two off. Goes to show just how weak those guys are. Up we go. It's got a bit of psycho this song, hasn't it, to it? Are we unaware of this place already? Man, crazy. I swear it was a bit bigger than this. Find a potion, yeah. I'll give that the squirt butt if he needs it. If he needs it, what are you saying, sign? I don't know. Trainer tips no stealing of Pokemon from other trainers, catching only wild Pokemon. Catch only wild Pokemon. You throw a Pokemon Pokeball whilst in a battle, and like they just spit slap it out of your hands. Um, let's try and find, let's get another battle in here, man. Let's get another battle in here. I really want to find a um, freaking Caterpie. How come we get no encounters? It's strange. I, mean, I thought you, you know, you get freaking loads of encounters. Here we go. Come on. Be careful what you wish for. I'm gonna get poisoned now. I guarantee it. Jesus, there's no Pokemon around. Anyway, I'll just chat to you, then, mate. What we gotta say, boy. Hey, wait up. What's the hurry? I don't wanna get out of here, mate. I wanna find a. I wanna find a freaking Caterpie. He wants to fight. He sent that Weedle. Oh, that's what he bloody well got on it. That's what he bloody well got. Uh, squirrel, mate, you ain't got a lot of life left. Let's give you a bubble. Bubble butt. Bubble, bubble, bubble butt. Squirrel's butt. 
out of the bubble, bubble, but. Ah, but it fell. Come on, mate. Bubble away. Bubble away. Blow them bubbles. There we go. Nicely done. Oh, poison sting, and I've been poisoned again. Fantastic. Get rid of those bubbles, mate. Get Blow those bubbles at him. Nicely done. Oh jeez. Bosh. Good guy. Good mate. What a mate. Is that a level up? 99 bloody XP. No, no level up. You're good at this. Thank you, mate. You're gonna let me continue my journey now? You're gonna let me stop interrupting me as I go up this thing? So I'm gonna use a antidote on you. And I'm gonna switch out to ba dum bum bum. Uh, switch out the riders. Slow ride. Come on, Caterpie. Caterpie? Ah, oh, why freaking Weedle? Weedle, Weedle, Weedle. I do not want a. I do not want a Beedrill. I want a. Um, I definitely want a Caterpie. I think. Have I got that right? Have I got that right, guys? Have I got it right that only Caterpies are Caterpies exclusive to Pokemon Blue? I don't think that's right. By the looks of things, I think it might be right. I'm gonna keep trying. We are on our way out of here anyway, so. Nicely done, nicely done, Riders! Riders, he's a Raider. We got lots of Weedles in here, lots of Weedles up in this hisse. I'm pretty, I'm getting pretty certain that this is, I keep forgetting man, because like, I think Fire Red is like a combination of, um, mm, I'm, I'm confused. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Because I think Fire Red is like a, a, a hybrid, ah, there we go, of, um, oh, he's only level three though, he's a three though. Should I just throw a Pokeball at him and just freaking do the up and B, up and B? There we go. One, two. Ah, oh, you bastard. Because if I use freaking Gust, I'm going to destroy him, aren't I? This is where you get your boy out. Your, your freaking one that you caught just for the sake of it. Munch plop. Go on, Munch plop. You're up, mate. Do your thing. This is going to be an epic battle now, guys. Oh, it's so epic. He misses first attack. String shot. He's gonna be even slower than before. Come on, mate. Caterpie, you tackle. Munch plop. Poppers, get your thing out. There you go. Oh, jeez, munch plop. Go steady on him, mate. Here we go. Munch plop. There we go. Oh, okay, that's enough. That's enough. Uh, item. Hook a ball. Up and B. Because that. I don't know. Someone told me that. That's just a thing. All right, Caterpie was caught. I keep wanting it to go one, two, three, then tell me it's caught. It goes one, two, three, it's caught. It's almost like on Pokemon Go, it's like four. It can go shake, 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 and then it can still escape before the stars pop up. But in this game, it's shake, 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 and if on that third shake, it's done. Um, do I want to give a cat a Caterpie? Yes, we do. He's going to evolve into Butterfree, and he's going to spit some sleep powder on him so uh on people because that's what i want him for so um um so sleep powder puts you to sleep so when you're sleeping uh let's call him sex we um sex but let's uh yeah let's go back Yeah, Sex Wiz or Sex Wiz? Sex Wiz. You can use Zeds again, look. Sex Wizzer. Sex Wizzer. There you go. And cool. Sex Wizzer's in the team. Let's, let's cure him and then uh, get... We'll, we'll, we'll pump him up soon enough. We'll get him pumped up soon enough. So he's going to be our boy to put in the status effects on our on our Pikmin that we want to catch because they're going to get a little bit harder as time goes on so um, we definitely want to have a guy like him in our team so we can uh, I definitely want that Abra and uh, Abra's have a friggin nasty um, nasty way of just running away from you all the bloody well time so he's the one he's the one man 
Yeah, fight and fit. Hope to see you again. Thanks, Nurse Joy. You look like the ones in order place. Where are we to now? Are we in? We're on the road to Viridian City. I don't know. I just think this is Viridian City. I don't think. I can't remember the names of the places. I gotta say, I uh, you know the name of the songs. Item uh, like Time Map. Where are we? We're in Pewter City. Viridian City is over there somewhere, in the middle of Voice Four. I can't. Oh wait, I just went past it. Oh, Viridian Forest. Viridian City. I went into Viridian City. We're on the road to Viridian City. I've done it already. So I've come from there, up here, and now I'm here. Okay, cool. So, uh, I can beat up Gary now, man. I can get my first badge if I want to, but I'm gonna just do a bit of exploring. Uh, let's try, maybe maybe we should uh, pump up Caterpie for a little bit. Should we pump Caterpie up? Mmm, pump the jam, pump it up. Wow, your feet are pretty sex wizard. Pump up that sex whiz. Get that sex whiz in his face. Put him to sleep, man, with your sex whiz. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah, pump the jam. Pump it up. Speed up. I'm not even in the freaking forest and I'm getting weedles all over this place. Sex wizard, go, mate. You, that, brr, that looks nasty. That From that angle, some of the close-up angles of these Pokemon on my side are just disgusting. It looks like a right munter, doesn't it? Look at that critical hit. It took hardly anything off. Oh, you bumhead. Okay, I'm going to have to switch you out already, mate. Oh, Jesus Christ. I even, like, thought about switching you out before you even finished your fight. Riders, get in there, Riders. Do his thing. You are the MVP of this team so far, man. Because, like, for those who don't know, like, I think, have I said it already? Like, you got... Yeah, I did. Like, if you... Because uh, Caterpie and Weedle have tackle, but if you just catch a Kakuna or a Metapod, their evolutions, um, they only have Harden, so they can't defend themselves, so there's no point. So you might as well get Caterpie and, and uh, Weedle, and then they're able to um, at least be able to bring him defend themselves. Because the moves they learn, as they have, the moves they have when they evolve, they carry forward, so yeah. So uh, it's good to have a Metapod that can have tackle. Come on, squirt butt! We gotta make that Caterpie nice and strong. I'm thinking like uh, maybe I should put Caterpie in the forefront of um, um, of our team when we're doing the gym battle. But I don't want to risk losing the battle, so I, uh, maybe not. Sex wizard, sex wizard. Um, squirt butt. Riders, come on, let's take it in turns. This is good for you guys watching me leveling up these guys. This is the part where I need to talk about other things. <laughs> what? I distract you. Mm, low ride. Okay, good either. Nicely done, mate. Nicely done. Level. Oh, wait. No, he just got his experience. It's not level 11. Come on, Caterpie. What level is he now? Level 3 still. Is he not leveled up yet at all? He's been in loads of battles. Um. This is the kind of the worst part of the game, man. Like the the, the initial kind of get going, because it's just a case of like building up your squad, and because um, I'm with me, um, I tend to um, stick with the same team that I have from the beginning. It's quite cool, but then near the end of the game, you do kind of like you do get your arse handed to you a little bit uh, in some instances, if you, especially if you get like status effects on you, like um, going through some of the caves in uh, some of the later parts of the game can be quite tricky. Uh, as long as you're not stupid, and you should be alright. By that time, you, you sh I should have a team that's nice, well-rounded. Because I guess my goal is now is to have Butterfree. When when Sex Wizard goes up to Butterfree, he will be able to stand on his own two feet because he will learn Confusion. And Confusion is a pretty badass move, I, I like to think. In my in my thing, um, it's quite a nice, good Psychic attack. And I think, in my my humble opinion, I think Psychic attacks in this game are OP. They really they really do tear up this. Uh, this uh, some Pokemon, so you can just like, uh, yeah, um, to have Butterfree learn that is quite cool. So you can stand on his own two feet pretty soon. So I'll have Squirt Butt, um, Sex Wizard, Riders would be nice and evolved into uh, into uh, his thing, his jam, Pidgeotto, Pidgeot, and then like Abra, Abra. So that'd be my four. I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do for my fifth and sixth. There's gonna be someone in there that's gonna be like a, a TM, a TM slave in there. Um, 
for those who don't know, you need HM Slave. You need certain abilities to get to places like down here. I can't access that place because I need Cut. And Cut, you need to teach a Pokemon how to do it. And that knocks out a slot in your attacks uh, forever. Whenever you learn new moves, you can you can, you can can uh, overwrite them if you want to with other moves. And then you can overwrite them again if you need be. But um, HMs are there forever, man. Oh wait, what are you doing? You're attacking me. Um, so, um, yeah, I need to have someone in the team that can just learn a bunch of HMs. Um, that'd be so. I'll probably have a nice solid team of five, I'll say. I don't want to give I don't want to give Squirtbutt any like um, HMs. I don't want to give him any like bloody Surf or anything like that. Yeah, it's a pretty badass move, Surf, but I don't. I just want to free up that slot. For other stuff and things. All right, guys. I think I've done enough grinding for now and enough chit chatting. I'll, I'll one more battle and then we'll make our way to um, Brock. Brock Lesnar. Um, here we go. Fight, and then we're gonna tackle. No, we here we went. Raider. Bum, bum, bum. I'm pretty sure he um, he evolves at level five as well. So yeah, like we like. Oh, you poisoned me, you bastard. Um. Carapy's uh, friggin' evolution and the bug bug Pokemon in general, they tend to like evolve into their final iterations before level 10 anyway. They're really quite fast evolvers in that way. So I'm just gonna go to the Pokemon Center and I'm gonna sort myself out, getting ready for Brock, man. Getting get dusted off. So, guys, thank you so much for watching this. We made our way through the forest, and now come back in the next episode as we attempt attempt to try and get our first badge. Oh yes! Cheers then guys, see you then, bye bye.